One of the latest Republicans to jump off of the Donald Trump Republican bandwagon is New Hampshire Senator Kelly Ayotte in a grueling re-election campaign of her own. I cannot vote uh, for Donald Trump based on what he said in those tapes and the actions he talks about in those tapes uh, that talk about assault against women. The crude disrespect of women in the GOP nominee's own words has had Republicans denouncing Trump since Friday. Ayotte delayed. You have to understand, people are outraged, though. Trump has said things about minorities, people with disability, gold star families, and you were backing him then. Well, I, I, all of, every time those things have happened, I called them out. I denounced him, and I disagreed with him. Uh, but, but you were going to vote the tape, for him then. But the tape uh, that I heard that was released on Friday, uh, that's fundamentally different in that it talks about assault and crimes. I'm a former cr prosecutor. She has stood with him on 35 different occasions. Democratic rival Governor Maggie Hassan caused the AOT flip-flop on Trump political self-preservation. Nothing has changed about Donald Trump in the last six days. What's changed is that Senator Ayotte realized that politically she couldn't stand with him anymore. Governor Hassan and Senator Ayotte together at a Manchester firehouse never shook hands. In Manchester, Rondella Richardson, WCVB, News Center 5.